Good day, Sijinov here. Today I will show you the quickest and the easiest way how to create opacity or transparency, call it however you want, map with Substance Painter. For example, we have this low poly helmet on which we want to transfer details and specially chain opacity from this high poly model. You could use any 3D package you want. I will go forward with Blender because this is my favorite and primary 3D tool. I recommend to separate this object in couple parts for avoiding glitches and artifacts after normal map baking in Substance Painter. And add suffixes underscore low for low poly and underscore high for high poly objects, which Substance Painter will use for baking process. So it's time for saving low and high poly FBX models. Select all low poly objects, file, export, FBX. I already did it, but I just want to repeat for you guys. In object types, pick mesh and pick select object checkbox. Let's name low poly object helmet low. And please repeat the same steps for high poly as well. Let's move to Substance Painter, File, New, pick our low poly mesh, OK. And for visibility of our back face normals, let's change a shader settings from PBR Metal Rough to PBR Metal Rough with Alpha Blending. Here it is. The next step is to bake normal map with custom settings. Let's deselect every single checkbox except normal. Output size, let's choose 2K. Decrease dilation width to zero and deselect apply diffusion checkbox. Pick our high poly mesh. Uh, Anti-aliasing, choose subsampling 4x4 and matching by mesh name. It means by suffixes that we have add in Blender before. Let's push bake button and wait a few seconds for finishing baking process. Okay, the baking process is done. We need to export our normal map for project shelf. Export, pick some folder. Okay, let's go to that folder. Here it is, our normal generated map with alpha channel, exactly what we want. Let's add some minor changes to this normal map in any app that could edit raster image. In my case, it is Photoshop. And erase all islands except chain. Set new layer, put it below layer 1 and fill completely with black color. And let's erase some parts that we can see before. Double tap on layer 1 and color overlay. Make sure that you fill layer with completely white color. And here it is, our opacity map, which we will import to Substance Painter. Okay, let's name it properly like opacity. Okay, let's return to Substance Painter and import this opacity map. Find alpha to our current project. Okay. Delete our old layer, create new folder, let's name it chain and create a black mask for chain part. Alt left click, let's go to polygon selection tool and select pick only island related to chain. Okay, here it is. Create new layer the layer put to chain folder and the last one we need to add opacity channel okay and for this 
layer opacity let's name it properly disable every single channel except opacity and pick for opacity color our opacity map that we have imported before okay and here it is our nicely baked chain with opacity just want to mention one more thing let's create a new layer about opacity please do not forget to switch off opacity channel in upper layers for not allowing override transparency after this you could rebake re normal map with apply diffusion checkbox and higher properties if you wish and generate curvature and AO maps as well let's do it Make maps return dilation value to 1 apply diffusion let's pick curvature and rebake it one more time let's wait a few seconds Okay, here it is, everything on his place. I hope this tutorial will be useful for you and see you later. Bye.